I knew it. What's up, Bunny Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, again, we are going to talk about Ticket Symbol ZM Desktop Matter. I know, I, I mean, I've covered this stock here on, on the channel, and I give you guys update as to what's going on with the company. And when I see opportunities where I think the price of the stock is going to move, I try to give you guys that update so you guys are aware. Uh, just for transparency, I do own Desktop Matter. I bought it a while back when... They were uh, like ten dollars when they just announced that they were going to go public. In case I read and, and understand the company, I see the business model, the use cases. Um, to me, I said this is going to be uh, a winner, and so I jumped right in there. So um, I wanted to give you guys some update that I have actually seen. So that's why I want to make this other video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, guys, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So for those of you guys that are new um, and don't know exactly what the business model here is, Destem Matter is a company that does uh, 3D printing uh, with Matter and uh, carbon fibers. I just recently did a video where I said they actually bought another 3D printing company, Envision Tech, um, to kind of expand your services and what they provide, which is awesome. So if you can see here, these are the different machines that they build. They build machines that can go from just you building, uh, you know, working in your basement to actually um, production uh, systems where you can actually use it uh, to manufacture a really big parts. So uh, this one right here is called their production uh, system. This is the one that, let me go back here. The production system, this is the one that you signed a contract with Ford to actually use that. To use that. So again, you can see here, uh, I've talked about the use cases a lot, so I'm not going to dive into that. The reason why I really wanted to do this video is because uh, one of my subscribers really pointed me to some key information that I didn't really uh, think about. So um, Again, thank you so much, um, Adena Nicola123, for really bringing up that information because um, this is information that would gives us some confirmation and validation that the the fact that we're bullish on this stock is for real. It's not just uh, some hypothetical stuff. So I'm going to switch over here. For those of you that know um, Katie Wood or Act Invest, a lot of people know her. She has become so famous in the last two years uh, because of her ETFs, uh, disruptive uh, technologies and stuff like that. So uh, I'm not going to go about trying to give you guys her credentials. She is one of the people that was so bullish on Tesla and she has been picking up some really good stocks and her ETFs have been performing like crazy. So that said, Again, one of my uh, subscribers pointed me to some key information here, and the information is that Cathy Wood in the last 10 days have actually added desktop meta. As you can see here, if I can highlight just that, they've actually added desktop meta to their portfolio of 3D printing, which is awesome. If you can see here, they bought the stock at average about $25 a share. And right now, the value of that is about $12.5 million. Guys, this is incredible news. This is validation that what we covered when we first covered this stock, I said, I see potential in this stock. I wasn't even thinking about uh, the fact that Cathy would, would be even interested in the stock. So now that she has actually added it to her portfolio, that gives me even more confirmation. Uh, that said, what I'm going to do right now, guys, again, like I already have uh, a good chunk of desktop matter. I'm definitely going to go buy more and really uh, it, it add more to my position because um, what that's telling me is that the, this stock is going places. Um, and, and again, this is my person. This again, guys, this is my personal take. Um, when I see that validation, um, my average entry uh, price right now is $10. I think $10 and some change. I don't know the exact um, uh, amount, but it's about $10 and some change. And so I think, again, that this stock has huge potential based on the use cases I've already explained here on the channel. And then getting this confirmation from Cathie Wood, them buying it, I'm like, huh, this is great. So now that I'm just doing this video, look at where uh, Desktop Meta is currently sitting. Uh, Desktop Meta is sitting at $25.12, which means they bought it right at that, that spike. And if you can see here, the high of this stock is $25.86. So they bought it at the high where some of us, uh, if I can go back here three months, 
uh, I actually bought it. Uh, where is it? My my entry price or it, this chart doesn't reflect it because um, when they went public, um, when they switched their name from uh, trying acquisition to desktop matter, I don't think that this chart is actually showing that. So this is not the right chart to show that information. But anyways, uh, what I'm trying to say here is that my entry price is way, way below. So if they see this as a good entry point and they're buying at $25, I think that gives a valuation, guys. This is great. So expect to see uh, a spike in the stock because now that Kathy Wood has it in her portfolio, a lot of people are going to start looking at it and say, oh, she bought it, and then I'm going to buy it. So expect to see a spike in the price of the stock to move up, maybe go test at like 28, even test 30. And so that's something that I, I, I'm anticipating that it's going to happen this week. So this is a uh, wonderful news. Desktop Matter has made it to uh, Kathy with ETFs list. And I think that's a really good validation for us. So if, if for those of you guys that have been following my channel, uh, I started talking about this company. I've been bullish about this company and I'm not holding back. So this again just gives me even more credence that this is gonna this is gonna go places. So let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this. Um again, uh just I want to give you guys some information here that I actually saw um from uh, CNBC Jim Kramer. So he said that a lot of investors are trying to mimic Kathy Wood. So what most people do is when they see, they go through her list because uh, she publishes the list of um, the companies that they buy. When people see that, then they go out and buy those same stocks and try to mimic her. Um, my advice to you is if you're somebody that does that, you are just you know, setting yourself, yourself up for failure. It might work, but the, the chances are that you're going to fail because they have a, a, a team that does research and you see sometimes they sell um, and buy. So it's not like they just buy and hold. They sell and buy, sell and buy, and balance their portfolio because it's an active managed fund. So you just trying to mimic them with your small uh, amount of money that you have, you're not going to keep up with them. I would advise you to just buy the ETF. If you think about what she's doing, you think it's great, instead of trying to buy the stocks that she has, just buy the ETF and move on. Uh, she's going to do the work for you. And the ETFs have been performing really good. So that's just my personal advice based on that information there, right? So don't try, go out there and try to mimic her. Uh, for me, again, like I, I, when I read about desktop matter, I didn't have to wait for her to buy the stock before I think this is great. I'm just telling you guys that I personally, I saw the use cases. I think this is great. This is something that fits. It answers a problem that we have in manufacturing today. And that's why I did love the stock. So definitely, guys. Uh, make sure that you always uh, understand the key things that drives you to invest into this stock, not just because Kathy would buy it, but to me, I see an issue, I see a solution that's scalable. So the issue is manufacturing sucks today because you have to go to uh, you know a plant, they build some molds and everything before they manufacture the product and ship it to you. But with 3D printing uh, metal like this, you put this here at, let's say, dealership, they can print it right there and just put it in your car. You don't have to worry about all the shipping costs and other stuff that comes with it. To me, that is a problem that is soft and it's scalable. You can put this all over the place, dealerships, even, I mean, stores, anywhere, any mom and pop can buy this machine and start printing parts. So to me, that's something that I saw in the company. Um, but if you just want to buy because Kathy would buy it, again, I'm saying that you're setting yourself up for failure. You might you not know, succeed, but there's a huge possibility that you can fail instead of buy her ETF and just move on. So that's just a, a word of caution that I wanted to give out to you guys. Uh, if you're new to the channel, guys, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. If there's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Webo is still doing a promotion right now where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get four free stocks. Links in the description below. And as always, guys, Always do your homework. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated. Uh -huh.